Hey everybody, welcome back to Satisfactory. Um, I did a lot of stuff in between episodes. Uh, in the last episode, we were working on getting our foundation down for our central processing building. And I have finally done it. This is a big old tree I never noticed before. That's pretty cool. Uh, anyhow, I have finally done it, and here it is. Check it out. So... <sighs> Uh, there is a, a little bit of explanation required into what I have, what this monstrosity is, what I've built here. But first, let me explain tonight's beverage. Tonight, we are drinking a barrel nut coffee. Barrel nut coffee is Frangelico, Irish cream, and Kahlua, and some coffee. And I get to drink it out of my cool fix-it mug. Cheers. Okay. So... The last episode ended with us being very confused, well, us, ended with me being very confused as to how the thing I had designed was not fitting. So obviously a little bit of redesign was necessary to get it to fit and it still doesn't quite completely fit based on this giant rock in the middle here, but it fits a lot better. So what I had to do is I shrunk it by five blocks width wise and it's about 20 foundations shorter in length. So these sections were 14 each, so like 14, 14, 14. They are now 10. So. Oh no. One, two, three, four, five. I just realized why this is not fitting the way I thought it to. I went too far in one direction. Oh my god, I can't believe I didn't notice that until just now. So it should be one, two, three, four, five sections, but I have six. That's why it was not fitting the way I wanted it to. It's all coming together. Okay, cool. That's cool. Um, so that is obviously something that I'm going to have to fix up. I also obviously still need to fill this stuff in, but we are not doing that this episode. Uh, what we are going to do instead is we are going to first off i have to go do some more criterium stuff i want to get my next space elevator milestone in order and then time dependent i want to come back here with some more parts i got my parts recoup and start uh kind of fleshing out what the walls and the roof and the floors in here are going to look like. Now, again, I'm going to probably do most of that off screen, but I want you to see the general design before we get too far. Okay. So, first off, let's go home. I can't believe I did that. That extra section. Because I, I, like, redesigned everything, and then it was still super long, and I couldn't figure out why it was still so long. Also, am I super lost here? Yes. Yes, I am super lost. <laughs> and that's why, because there's an extra section in there. But I still swear, like, I built this thing with that width on my old, um, on the waterfall factory save, and it fits, so I don't know. Who knows what I've been doing? <laughs> Not me, that's for sure. Okay. So, let's go back here. I see something red, which is never a good sign. What were you making? Quick wire. Cool. And this is where the Caterium ingots are going. That's my concrete. Okay. Let us do some stuff here. Wait, first off, what's red? You're red because you're out of biomass, but I'm not super concerned about that right now. Especially since I have no biomass to put in there, so that solves that problem. Also, I'm clicking a dragon again. I gotta stop that. Bad habits die hard, apparently. Um, 
Cool. So, I want to... Oh god, leaves here too. I want to... Go and start harvesting some coal. And harvesting that Caterium node over, over in that direction. So that's going to be the goal for this episode. And then time dependent, we will maybe come back. Oh, look at that. Pretty sweet. Anyhow, we're nowhere near that. So let's just stop looking at that. And once again, I'm probably going to ignore jump pads. Sorry, jump pads. Cool. Well, I can pop my wire in here for now. And you know what? I can probably pop the frames in there now, too. So I got should have lots of that stuff. A couple other things I want to do. Okay. Uh, I want to have the frames hooked up to a storage box. That one I have to click and drag because I want I don't want a full other stack. Um, same with this. So frames, and I also want rotors. Now, I don't know if I have enough rotors here. Oh, no, I do have some rotors. How come these rotors aren't going anywhere? Do I have two rotor machines? Oh, no, it's because you're... Oh, I'm creating more rotors than I can use. That's excellent. I will take them all and take these plates, too. Okay, sweet. So, we're going over there. What do we need for over there? We are going to require two coal generators. We are going to require two miners, a smelter, and two truck stations. So we need a bunch of concrete. Concrete? Concrete? Oh, it's over here. My bad. Excuse me, bird. I'll take it all. Yeah, I absolutely devastated my concrete supply. Building that giant, unnecessarily large base. Factory. I guess I'm calling it a base, too. That's another bad habit that's got to end. Cool. So let's get basic steel production. I'm not doing anything with steel yet, but let's just keep this party rolling while, while we're doing stuff here. I still have enough rotors, yes? Yes. Launch. Okay. Uh, I'm going to need one more miner. Ugh, I'll just build two. An additional project part can now be constructed. Progress to the next phase is now possible. And we'll get rid of these power shards too while I'm at it. Did I not research that? Power slugs? Oh, because I needed a bunch of rotors. Oh. Fun times. Okay. There we go. Alright, but I, I ate it, so I don't have any more. Cool. Now, truck. Can I get you down here somehow? I think the answer is yes, but I gotta go this way. <laughs> Perfect. So let's go get some Caterium. Oh no, are you serious? It's not that deep. Okay, there's no crate. No, that's good. Get some lights. And we'll give our concrete some time to recoup so we can go back and work start working on our central processing building. And because I've narrowed it I might have to redo the idea I had for the walls and the roof. Not redo it. Modify it slightly. We'll call it that. Oh, 
Oh, also, I really need to find... Um... What you call it? The blueprint designer. I'm assuming it, it's somewhere under the space elevator. It's, it's in this tier. It's in tier three or four, so I should have it unlocked. I'm just not sure where. We also... Oh... Um some point in the next couple episodes we're gonna have to go and start looking at explosives as well that is something that is going to have to happen because there's a lot of those stink plants where i need to build our central processing building am i gonna fit fit come on off-roading yeah built fix it tough Okay, we're going to fit through here. Yes. Haha, <laughs> get wrecked, spider. Cool. Yeah, so there's this path here. And this... We're going to have two... Oh god, I'm going to need... Um, dynamite for this as well. Get rid of these stink plants. Okay. Give me those. So let's start with a miner. Miner's gonna be here. And we're gonna get some standalone coal power generation up here. Okay. Cool. I will take my coal generators. Two is probably more than I need here, but whatever. I hear a spider. Was it just dying in the smoke somewhere? Do I spot more frames here? I do spot more frames here. Yoink. Oh, oh, I made it. Sweet. I didn't think I was going to make it, but then I made it. And everything was great. Okay. Uh, we're going to need to bootstrap this, of course. Oh, you're not going to fit here? <gasps> you are going to fit here. That's fantastic news. We need you at 75%, please. Cool. All right. Let's get this set up before we go too much farther down that road. Oh, let's, let's nudge it. Oh, I can't nudge this one? Ah, I can nudge it. It's got to lock it first. Okay. That makes sense. You need to be like so? That looks correct. Sweet. All right, there we go. Now we can use Mark I belts for this, which is good. So I'm gonna need all these Mark II, or um, plates in my inventory for something else. And that something else is hauling down all my Caterium stuff from up there. Oh, you know what I didn't bring? Uh, smelters. 
Oh, I did. I only brought one, though. Or, not brought, but, like, have the parts for. So that is going to have to be fixed as well. Now you are going to require a splitter. Okay. All right. Let us bootstrap. That is not how we bootstrap. <laughs> Let us try that again. Okay, that's how you bootstrap. Come on, cool. Hey. Yeah, and this is not going to be connected to the main grid. This is going to be its own thing. I got to drink this before it gets cold. <gasps> Hostile activity. Stop being hostile. <gasps> oh, no. Anybody else want a tango? Show me the smoke. Yeah. What is that? Oh, okay. It's a spitter. That is way less crazy than I thought it was. And I see you up there. Oh, I was talking about getting the, um, I'm out of inventory space? No, why can't I pick this up? I was talking about getting the explosives. I can't do anything with explosives until I have, excuse me, my steel industry up and running, so. We're not going to worry about that yet. Okay, this is looking good. Yeah, stable, everything's nice and happy here. I got lots of power to work with. Yeah. So, the other thing we're going to need down here is one truck stop here. Like so. Yes. And we're going to need a splitter. A splitter is what we we're going to need. Uh, and I'm going to have Mark II coming this way. And you're not loading up because you're not powered. That's fair. And my Caterium truck station. I'm wondering if I should just... Oh my god, that scared the crap out of me. I wonder if I should keep my Caterium truck station up there. Or bring it down here. I think I'd rather bring it down over there somewhere. Let's eat some of these berries. Get him out of my inventory. Okay. So that's all running. Uh, I would like some coal, please. Take your coal. I'm going to steal your coal. Although, I guess now that this is hooked up, I could have just drove under this and that would have solved all my problems. No, all too late. Yoink. You know what? Eh, that's fine. We'll come back this way. 
uh, any fuel. Okay. Oh, I have to hit F to load now. I forgot about that. <gasps> that is magnificent. We are going to, in that case... Are we going to do anything about that? Yes, we're going to feed this thing. What? What? What happened? No, oh, the tasty berries! Okay, well, whatever, I tried. In that case, we're gonna put the truck station down here. The second truck station. Oops, that was the right direction. I didn't want to put them side by side because I was afraid I would accidentally load one thing by accident onto the wrong truck, but that's not something that can happen anymore. So that's great. Um, it does mean, though, I should probably have fuel going to that as well. Yeah. All right. And that would be my Caterium truck station. So, for now, let us go up there. Now, the best way up there... I don't, I don't actually know if it's this way or not. Coming through! <laughs> okay, it turns out it is this way. Well, sweet. Okay, that was by far the best way to get up here. Good to know. That thing always sounds like the fly spawning. Okay, there is a power pole down here somewhere. Nice. And all these hogs are back. And this is regular? Normal, yeah. Why are you red? I don't understand why it's red. It's running. this again, eh, guys? <laughs> yeah, well, th those guys aren't bugging me. How's it going? So you're doing 60 per minute. With a smelter. That is not a smelter. You know what? Let's do a bigger one. I hear more I hear more hogs. <laughs> Whoa, that was not what I wanted. Okay. Smelters. How many Caterium can you do? 45 per minute. Uh, okay, well, we will do two, and then I will stick a slug in here, and this will be 90. And that'll be perfect. What is grunting? Okay. 
Okay. And you are outputting 15. And you are also outputting 15. And you don't have power. So good job, me. There we go. Now, in-game production is going to have to be ramped up at some point. But for now, this will be just fine. What did I do? I did it backwards. That's the first one. First one of the series. It was bound to happen eventually. Oh no, I didn't do it backwards. I just did the completely wrong thing. Well, still. <laughs> Not any better, to be honest. Okay, cool. So we gotta run this down here. This is all very reminiscent of many past playthroughs. You don't want to line up nicely. So you know what we're going to do? We're going to work this from the bottom. And we're going down the fast way. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, okay. So, that thing is there. Let's do this. Now let's do this closer. Kind of the same orientation. Yeah, okay. Yeah, guts here for me. Wait, are you guts? You are guts. Excellent. Okay, and that is the story about how I got my Caterium going. <laughs> Sweet. This should be filling up nicely. I should probably make this a Mark II belt, actually. There we go. Perfect. Um... So this is going to be the beginning of our steel industry coal. At some point, I will need another miner over here. So why don't we just get that in there now? How is our power doing here? I've got tons of power here. Power is, dare I say, overwhelming. Okay. Give me some craft bench. Now I'm hoping, is this pure? Yeah, I, th I think this is pure as well, right? Normal. Hmm. There's a pure one up here. I think there's two pure and two normals. Pure? Yep. Pure. There's three pures here. Well, I think two peers will be plenty because this coal is only temporarily supplying our steel industry. I might use this coal patch in the late game, possibly for our nuclear facility. So this is only going to be temporary coal for steel. Uh, I should have done this before I came over here. But we can get it set up here because we're here. And then we don't have to do it later. Cool. Yep. 
Easy parachute. Am I still connected? I am. No. Yeah. Okay. Alright, get this run over. Again, I know it's a little early to be doing this, but... If I do it now, I won't have to do it later. Okay. And... All the progress we're making fun times so i'm gonna put a cut in here when we come back um no i'll i'll actually i'll come back once we're back at the at our uh temporary our permanent temporary factory i was gonna say i'll we'll bring this back in the next episode but i will have brought it back before i come back you don't need to see me drive through here again you know how that works so yes uh, when we come back, we'll be at the permanent temporary factory. We're going to unload some of the stuff, maybe do a little bit more Caterium research. And then I think I'm going to start outlining um, what the central processing facility is going to look like. Kind of work on that design a bit more for all of you guys to see. And hopefully I haven't also screwed that up severely. But we will find out in the next episode. So until that time, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. If you did, please give us a like and subscribe. It helps us out a lot. We will see you next time. Cheers.